when people say haters are your biggest fans, I didn't realize they literally meant people who are still in your hometown who are hating on you because they're still in your hometown will teach others who come up in your hometown about you. And then those others will come to this big city sometimes and see you and be like, oh my gosh, are you Kira? Did you happen to go to so-and-so high school and live around so-and-so place? I learned about you from, names my biggest hater who happens to be my ex-best friend. Literally, I learned about you from. That, those were the words that years after our friendship breakup, years after the fact, this girl comes up to me at a party and says, oh my gosh, I learned about you from, names my ex-best friend, and starts talking about how much she loves my work and everything that I do, and says that she was just jealous of you, referring to my ex-best friend. Now, I've never seen this girl in my life. This girl is also much younger than me and was like, I think, well, like five years younger than me was like a full high school cycle below me because I she, we didn't go to high school together but she went to my high school which is another red flag because um and this is a thing I really want to talk about honestly I'll probably make another video about this like when friends of yours keep getting friends who are younger like let's say like 19 okay let's say you're both 19 you have friends that are your age maybe like a couple friends that are a little bit younger you go away to college when you come back, the friends stay the same age. Like that Taylor Swift shit. Just like that, but for friends. Do you know what I'm talking about? When your friends just like have a lot of younger friends and like you might go and come back to that city because you like really live somewhere else and you, you just keep visiting them through the years. Why are you, why do you have new circles of friends and they're younger than you? And then we're, we're 20, we're 22, 23 and your friends are still 19 or 18. Dare I say, maybe there's this, I don't know. And I used to just think, oh, like she's being a mentor. And then it started to get, it, it started to get weird at a certain point. You know what I mean? And I don't know if it's because everybody else just left. Like, I don't know what the reason is. Whatever. That's a different tangent. But it was funny because this girl who is like five years younger than me, and who I didn't know when I was friends with her, which means she's a newer friend. She said that she had to cut this person off. And I'm like, if somebody much younger than you, well, like, you know, in when you're in your younger 20s, if someone's five years younger than you, that's, that's getting to a different life stage, in my opinion. No, I think that's true. <laughs> I think if you're a teenager, it's different than being 24, 25, 26, okay? Um, the way she had phrased it was very interesting because it sounded like not only did this person talk a lot of shit about me, but she couldn't resist making me sound really sick in the process somehow, even though she was obviously being a hater because this person said to me, she was just jealous of you, which implies things were said that were maybe not so nice. But ultimately this person's impression of me was positive or positive enough to look me up and then, and then become a fan. She said, I'm a fan. So yeah, your haters are your biggest fans. They, they, they spread your gospel. They spread your word. And at the end of the day, if, you're, if your gospel is spread, I'm not God, okay? This is, I was raised Catholic. So sometimes these um, biblical kind of words come out of my mouth and I think it's fun to play with verbally, but just understand, I know I'm not God, okay? And I'm not trying to act like I'm spreading any kind of religion. So let's just reel that in. Um, my point is the fact that she is talking about me enough to like make other people aware of me and make them become fans is it's hilarious. It's hilarious to me. And I do genuinely hope she's doing well. I hope she's doing well.